guys this is grand leech and welcome to my channel today i'm going to show you guys how to get some honey but before we are not going to concentrate on the honey making let's just move this bird first okay so we need to oh okay this is one of my friends I thought she was online. All right, so we are going to create a beehive, and for us to create a beehive, beehive, we're gonna have to unlock it, and it's gonna be on tier. Let's see, fifty-nine guys. So you're gonna have to be a little bit higher on your levels. Um, to unlock the beehive but if you have let's go create the beehive and the thing is for the beehive to work you're gonna need rare flowers and I'm gonna show you guys how to get a lot of rare flowers right so this is how the rare flowers look like I hope it's in here oh, there is a few 58 rare flowers so for the beehive to work, we're going to need some rare flowers. You can always get the beehive through this outpost thingamajig. The thing is, you're going to have to buy it with your golden stash. And then it works with tickets. So... You're going to be able to buy the beehive with a hundred slips or ticket slips, whatever. And if you don't know how the beehive works, I lost my first beehive because I just like attached it to a tree, which will be those redwood trees. And I didn't, I thought, well, okay, maybe I'll wait a little while and then the um, bees will come to the beehive, I don't know, and they will create honey. And that didn't work. You're gonna have to put wildflowers in there. For us to get wildflowers, we're gonna take the, these little theory xenosaurus. Therese xenosaurus. <laughs> and we're gonna get on them. Well, I'm not gonna take this one because this one doesn't belong to me. And if it does, then I'm gonna have a lot of trouble. So I'll take mine. Ugh. 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 Just get on there. Alright, so we're gonna move towards the swamps, guys. Ugh, just climb over it. Just climb over it. Really? No, here we go. So there's still a lot of work on this base, guys. We're gonna get stuck. I'm gonna show you a lot of stuff on how to make a lot of things. Let's first go to the swamps. So I'm basically situated right here. What's the coordinates? It's 76.4 latitude and 37.1 longitude. Now we're gonna go. What's this? This looks like a. Oh, it's nothing dangerous, okay. I thought, oh my god, here's a raptor. I don't know, they're spawning a lot of dangerous stuff around here lately, but okay, never mind. Let's go to the swamps. Swamps, swamps. Let's go on the beat. Let's go to the swamps, swamps, swamps. I'll show you guys exactly where to go. Oh, but these plants, it's basically plants that grows all over the swamps. What do you call it? Cattails. I'm not great with flowers, guys. Really, I'm really not great with flowers. Oh, my little... I always have these little shittles that follow me. Okay. It's go up. 
so basically this area usually has these flowers um, let's have a look i don't really want to go deep into the swamps let's have a look and i don't want to trigger stuff oh really but it's these flowers guys So all you need to do is swipe on the left hand side up and you'll collect the flowers. Swipe the flower on your left hand side upwards on your screen and you'll get these flowers. Let's just sort this guy out. Oh. On your left hand side, and you get a lot of great flowers. Swipe again, little one. Real cool. Right, let's get some more. Swipe up. Okay, let's head back to the base. So this area, let me just show you guys, is on latitude 70.6, longitude 43.4. So you can go and get these cattails. I don't know, do you guys call it cattails? I don't know. But those flowers. We're going to use these flowers for our beehive to collect honey. Right. <clears throat> Let's head back to the base. Luckily for me, the swamps are really close to my base, but the woods are not. So Come on. No time to rest, we need to work. Is that a snake and a crocodile? I must say. This is crazy stuff. Something's happening with this ecosystem. Usually there used to be only like Brontos around here, you know, and these little guys, and the turtles, oh it's like hectic stuff that are roaming around here, alright, so we're almost, almost, almost there, Ooh. this way around right let's get up get the prime meat is there any left maybe let's just increase your weight and your health maybe 
Well, there's not really much. I'm not gonna really bother. I'm just gonna change my view. Let's just have a look, guys. And um, if you do make your, if you do make your beehive, <clears throat> so it's in here. You see, it takes sap. It takes tree sap, guys. So before you can even think about making any beehive, you're gonna have to get yourself a tree sap tap, create that, and then when you have enough sap, you can create the beehive, right? So we're gonna create the beehive in any case. Let's craft it. So that's quite expensive to make if you think about the sap. Because it takes quite some time to actually create the tree sap. Okay, let's go to... To the forest, to the woods. And now we're going to put our beehive. Did I even take that now? I mean, honestly. Did I take it? Getting a little bit older, I think. Alright, so let's go to our wooden platform in the woods. Guys, you don't need to get a wooden platform to place the tree sap, tap, or the beer. Um, oh my damn, I have to take the flowers. Um, but yeah. It's probably a little bit safer to put it up high, but I don't think you're going to have any issues putting it down low by the tree. Let me just get the freaking rare flowers, guys. And honestly, we just went out to go get the flowers. Aish, it's been a long, long day in this paradise. Right, let's get some meat for this bird. There you go, now I can eat some. Alright, let's go. Okay, so at this redwood wood, um, red tree forest um, there's some trees that you can actually chop off and there's trees that's in game so you're gonna put that beehive against one of the in game trees uh, but I'm gonna I've got a platform and I'll show you guys how to place it if you do have a platform and if you don't have a platform a little bit glitchy today. Wonderful. Oh, let's get this going. Guys, and remember, we're going to have to, you know, get these things if you really want to, you know, be in front of the game, you know, ahead of it all, because you're going to need, honey, you're going to need tree sap etc for the mo more advanced recipes where's my little tree platform here we are okay so as you can see uh, okay we can't see anymore there's some tree sap taps and it's basically between every one of these steel thingamajigs that's against a tree um, you can put something so let's see the beehive sometimes it doesn't want to click in but let's see the other side so I can put it here I can't put it here because it's got a tap here 
and I've got a beehive here already so I can't put it there but I can maybe put it here you see so sometimes it, it's a little bit difficult to place it so you can place it over there it's between those two steel structures um, and then if you don't have a, a tree platform you can just put it below so I've got a tree tap here and you can just put it here it's easy as that so let's put it over here it's a little bit high though guys but you can still place it here let's place it over there hopefully we'll be able to reach it okay and let's put some flowers in there so let's put about 300 in there oh something's attacking me oh my son oh corner 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 why are you attacking my freaking bird i mean honestly where are you where are you are you dead that's where you are you see that's what i'm saying guys it's not ideal to um actually make a and you know, I don't want to give me its meat um, to make your very first base in the woods because it can get a little bit rough in here not right here but it gets a little bit rough there's a lot of terror birds in the woods and they are a real pain in the ass all right so we've got our honey or our hive our beehive Let's see how much wood, or how much it's going to take. About 43 minutes, guys, to make one honey. Oh, no, so I don't know. I, don't, I think it's one honey. But, yeah, it's going to take that long. Let's go upstairs and see if there's some honey up here. Ooh. Why are you not landing? There you go. So I've got this one here. Whoa, look how much honey I have. I've got a whole lot of honey. I don't think I'm going to be able to carry everything. No, it's not that, that heavy. Let's see. So I've got a lot of honey. And I think I've put in about 200 flowers in here. So I don't know how much one flower makes, but we can wait a little while and see. The flowers are at 97 quantities, so we'll see. And the next flower, the next honey will be produced in 15 minutes. So we'll have a look. Whoa, that looks so delicious. We'll have a look. 97 and then hopefully it gives you more than one honey for every how many minutes 50 one hour that's a little bit hectic okay so i'll see you guys in a little while in like 15 minutes and 18 seconds time okay guys i'm back and we're gonna see how much honey we got from that 97 flowers uh wow quite a bit well guys it's a lot and we've only used seven flowers so you get quite a bit on one flower let's say it's it around about four or five honeys per flower i would guess and that's it guys um that's on how to make honey oh my soul and it's my dog barking in the background the naughty one um and that's me guys that's me crowned leech please please guys watch my videos the whole video subscribe and share enjoy your evening or morning okay Bye-bye.